I was very fortunate. I had uh, great parents, great grandparents, teachers who grew up in a little town, Valparaiso, and we just had good values and, and they were transmitted to me. And I had an advantaged childhood, I grew up poor. <laughs> so I, I knew that if I wanted, to, wanted something in life, I was gonna have to work and work hard to get it. And that's, that's a good value to have. So that's our first core value, work hard, seriously. And uh, it'll, it'll get you places in life. Um, so, of course, striving to be better, it's just like, it's, it's what we do. I, 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 you, you cannot get ahead and, and stay the same. You have to be better uh, just to, you know, stay, uh, stay where you're at. And if you want to get ahead, you, you, you want to learn, you want to always look better, you know, uh, be better, learn more. Um, we, um, do what we say we're going to do. And that way it's like, well, of course, you know, that's all you have is your word. You know, again, that was just like, well, duh, <laughs> yeah, to me. And, and when, I, when I saw that didn't always happen in the business world, I go, well, that's wrong. <laughs> of course, that works in life. Of course, it's gonna work in business, and it does. And it's proven to be the case. People are just like, they say, wow, what a, what a great contractor, because he does what he says he's gonna do. <laughs> well, of course you would. Um, so that's just a core thing. Um, we're compassionate. Um, you know, I care. You know, again, of course you do. You know, of course we do. Um, so the people who work for me, they care. They, they care about the company. They care about our clients. They care about their family, their community. And uh, uh, um, of course, you know, that's just who we are. And our final core value, I believe, is we, we uh, promote uh, optimism and fun. Creativity, optimism, and fun. Well, you have to be creative if you're gonna have a business and like I say, the world's always changing and curveballs come and, and things happen, good and bad. And, and you have to be creative to survive in business. Uh, you have to be optimistic. I, I, you know, no matter what's going on, I expect a, a good outcome and uh, so some really bad things have happened in our company and they're going to happen. Good, good things happen to, bad things happen to good people. Uh, so it's just like in your personal life, but we're gonna make lemonade out of this. And, uh, and I just always expect good things to happen and they do. And then of course we're gonna have fun. That's what we're here for, you know, it's a, <laughs> uh, a lot of times Laura and I say, well, have fun. That's what I'm here for. <laughs> and, and we really are. And so you can have fun. And you hear, you know, stories about our guys singing in the basement and having fun out there hauling bucks and, run, and, and hauling buckets and, and running jackhammers. Yeah, you can have fun. You can have fun in the office. You can have fun as, in the sales, uh, as a sales consultant, visiting people's homes. And you're there to take care of business, but it, there's no reason you can't have fun while you're doing it. In fact, you should. We, we spend so much time at work. If we're not having fun there, we're just squandering opportunities. So.